Hello, you all. I decided to come look at some more manufacturer home. Right now, I'm at Magnolia Manufacturer Homes here in Vicksburg, Mississippi. Let me make sure. Okay, Ma uh, Magnolia Estate. There it is right there. And Vic, oh God, you guys, wait a minute. Did we see this one? This one has been here for a while. This is the one um, I'm trying to, I need the floor plan for this one because I, I love this one. Let's see, let's see what's going on with this, okay? You got your window there, there, there. Let me see, can I come back this way, so. Let's see, that's beautiful, you all. Now that's the door I came in over there, right there. Once again, this decor is decoration. Oh my God, it's beautiful. I like the floors because right here you don't have that carpet. You don't have the carpet. Oh my God, they decorated this so beautiful. Okay, right here, I didn't, okay, you all, I didn't let you all see. I don't want to take you all too quick. But a closet, when you walk from this door and you come in, this is the, when you come in, the entranceway. Mm, I love the curtains, you all. I love the way this looks. Hmm. Okay, what size? No, I have to get the size on this one. Definitely, I got to get the size on this one. Definitely. I'm getting the size on this one. I like the way this comes in. Your kitchen. You got a lot of cabinet area. I mean, yeah, a lot of cabinets. Drawers. And your cabinet. I love the, oh my God, see, I don't think I would get a house built from the ground up when you can have this. When you can have this right here. It comes with a microwave over the top of the stove. You know, a friend of mine said something about these. See, I would have a problem with this. I would, I love it. But she said, Phyllis, sometimes people are short if they have a bowl of hot soup. The manufacturing company, y'all just think about that. Just think about that, okay? Something to think about on that. Because uh, a person that's short, what would they do to get this out? Because my hand, you know, I'm on my tiptoes now to grab this. But I like it, but I wish it was lower. And also, this is where everybody's talking about where I see this right here where you can put water in in your pot and um, while you're cooking. I think that's pretty good. I like that. Me, myself, with the stove, I would go with gas myself, but I love the electric stove. I love this electric stove. This is beautiful. The kitchen is just to die for you all. It's just that that microwave is too tall for me but if i had to go with it that size if they couldn't drop it down i don't know you know what maybe i'm gonna ask them do they kind of custom design a little bit right here you all i love this part look if you open this door you can put a deck out here you can put a deck out there See, if I bought this house, they would have to give me this furniture. I wanted to stay just like this. Oh, a full-size refrigerator. I didn't show you all that. They would have to keep let me have the decorations in here. Okay, your, your regular-size refrigerator. Oh, my God, look up here. The lighting. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh, yeah, this one does come with a dishwasher. I didn't show you all this. I'm sorry. And a sink. And your dishwasher. Right here. Right there. Mm. And up over here, 
you have lights. This whole part for your lighting over your dinette table. I think that I like this better than I would a chandelier. I think I like this better than I would a chandelier. Plus, I'm a YouTuber, so you all know I need all the light I can get. Okay, you all look right here. This once again is the living room. I know I keep taking you guys back to the same old thing. But I just like the way it's decorated in the TV or the fireplace. You could go with a bigger TV. Nice ceiling fan here. Okay, now let's check out this. This right here, you, when you branch off from the living room, you got another closet right here. There's the living room. There's your closet. If you have guests, that would go straight off right into there. Oh my God, this is beautiful. I like the way they have the two doors for the hot water heater and all. When you, your furnace, your hot water heater and your ductwork, all that. I like the way they have the doors. You got the double doors. Woohoo! Excuse me, y'all. I didn't mean to make all that noise. Ha ha. But this is a real live, not live, a real video. No editing. <gasps> What the this oh that's beautiful up here. I love it. I love it. Your cabinets in here for your washer and dryer hookup right here. Right here. Oh, I love it. And your rod where you need to probably hang up some things. You know, I'm the type of person sometimes you need to wash stuff out on your hands, and they're they're very delicate, and you don't want to throw them in the dryer. There's your rod. And this comes with two cabinets right here. Yeah. Your utility. Oh, this must, wait a minute, this goes up. Oh, well, I don't wanna pull it down. Wait, I gotta go back out and look at this. Because also this comes with a porch. I'll show you all, it's beautiful. Okay, me, the carpet would have to go. But it's some real flush, flush carpet right here I love it it's very nice and the only reason okay this is the master closet wow I'm in the master room I'm in the master room this is the closet wow okay the, I love the carpet color and all the only reason I say I don't want to go with carpet is because this house would have to be placed in the country and in the country, we got rock roads. I got kids that come in and out of mud and everything. And I have uh, people, you know, I might waste a cup of juice. If you waste a cup of juice on carpet, you got to go through that pad. But for those who want carpet, great, because this room looks beautiful with carpet. It looks beautiful with carpet. Love the curtains. That's beautiful. Okay, the master bath. All righty, you got the two sinks and your commode is in here and you got your vent up in here and you got your commode. So it's off from the bathtub. Mind you, you got a lot of cabin space over there. Oh, here's your shower, you all. I don't think you guys, I'm not gonna take you all to, oh wow, that shower. I don't wanna go too far in because you may not be able to see. It's a place you can sit at. You can, you can sit down while you take a shower. Great, look at that, love it. There's your shampoo holders and all, concrete. I love the way that's designed on the floor. I love the tile on this floor right here. You got a lot of cabin space in your bathroom. Let me tell y'all, once again, I done became a minimalist. <laughs> when you get to be my age, you don't want all that stuff. This would be excellent. Look, see, me, my, my, cab, my counter would look just like they have a design right here. Okay, maybe I'll put toothpaste, toothbrush. See, I love the way this is. The less the more beautiful it is to me. The less is better for me. <laughs> okay, here's the lighting up here. 
I see the refrigerator is on. I thought maybe the lights would be on in here. Wow. Okay, they got a closet right here in the master, and you got a closet right here. Maybe that's for shoes. Maybe that's for another way you want to decorate it. I don't know, but the master bedroom is really big and beautiful. Let's look at this again. Let me let you all look and just give you guys a little small tour with the camera a little bit from the outside. So you can see more clearly. Hmm, right there. I love that, the way that it. Some people probably would put, people say they would put a TV right there. Hmm. Well, you couldn't put a TV right there because I don't see a socket right there. No, couldn't put a TV right there because they don't have a socket right there. But uh, you can always do put you on there. Okay, well, let's see. Let's see, okay, once you come in, mind you, we're back in the living room. Once again, that was the beautiful kitchen. Did I show you guys a nice angle of this? Kitchen. Let me make sure, because when I go out the door, okay. All right, then you walk down here from the living room, right here, right here, it's the living room, and right here you walk down the hall. The master is over there, so let's see what we got going on over here. Hmm, another bathroom. See, less, less is better. This is beautiful, beautiful bathroom, full-size bathroom right here. I love the lighting up here. You guys, I feel in love. I feel in love. Oh, the bathtub is really big. This is a bigger bathtub than what it usually is. I probably would change that shower head to a bigger shower head for me to come in here or guest or whatever. You could change it out. Then you got your commode right here. You got your cabinet. All right, once again, here's another bedroom. These bedrooms are big. So this is a three bedroom? God damn, big. this is really big, you all. I gotta take you all out there on the porch so you guys can see the porch, how beautiful it is. But you can kind of see a little bit of it right here. That's the porch right out there. Okay. The closet. I don't have any small children, so this wasn't wouldn't really be, um, you know, usually manufacture home with small kids. It's like, oh, I wouldn't want them to damage nothing because it's very easy. So I don't have any small kids. All my grandkids are big, so this would be just right. Okay, this is a three bedroom, look like, because that's a bedroom. This is a bedroom. Once again, this one comes with carpet. Wow, these bedrooms are huge. Two bathroom, two full bath. They're huge. So the guest bedroom even has a big closet. Uh-oh, focus, focus. Y'all, I'm losing my focus. I'm losing my focus. There it go, coming back in. Alrighty. <sighs> okay, you all. I want to let you guys see the porch. Wait, this is another closet. Oh, wow. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. You have guests to come. And plus, if you live like me, living in the country, I don't think my guests would ever leave. Okay, let's try this. You guys, it might be kind of noisy, but I don't mean for it to be. Also, look at this beautiful door that comes with this manufactured home. And we're in Vicksburg, Mississippi. Down 61 South. 
Okay, look at the porch, you all. Love it. See, me? Would I ever leave my house? I doubt it. <laughs> I'm not going to put a whole lot of stuff in here either. <laughs> look how long that porch is, you all. And I think the, and you get them with the ceiling fans. You got four ceiling fans on here. And you got the rockers. And you got one, two lights at the, right here. And there's your door. Oh, and somebody bought this one already, but you can always have one made. This one is so beautiful. All right, I'm going to the next money factory home. I don't think I'm going to look at a whole lot of them, but you all stay tuned. Okay, I didn't show you all the, um, the outside of this home. Right here, I didn't show you the outside, but this is beautiful. Okay, here I go to this next one right here. I probably make this my last one. Then again, I might look at that one down at the end. Now this one is number two. Let's see how this one's gonna look. We're in Magnolia Real Estate. Is it real estate, I think? But it's on 61 South. Let's check out this one. Knock, knock. Who's here? Okay, this is nice. Uh-oh. I'm going to leave the door open so I get more lighting in here. Right here, when you walk into the door, what you see, you have this. Wow, this looks almost like a hunting house. Cause you got dog hooks right here you can hang your coats up on. It looks like something for people that likes to hunt, but to each of them who wants it. When I come in the door from that way, let me let you all see. And then we see the kitchen. Coming in. Right here as I come in. There's the kitchen. There's the living area. And we're going to check out the living area. And there's a room right here. Well, let's check out the bedroom first. Let's see. I love this charcoal, but by me being a YouTuber, I would have to go with something white. Cream color or something like, oh my God, you all, the bathroom is gorgeous. I wonder what they give me the stuff that goes in it. <laughs> oh my God, this is nice. I love this. This is beautiful, gorgeous. Oh no, the two mirrors come with it. Look. There I am right there. See, me being a minimalist. I would see, the way they got it decorated, that's how much stuff need to be there for me. I don't need no more stuff to sit up there. If they gave me that stuff, that's it. I'm not putting no more, I ain't putting no more up there. I become, I'm, I'm becoming a minimalist. Oh, wow. I want a house I can enjoy without filling it up and it still looks beautiful. See, you don't have to fill this house up and it's still beautiful if you don't put anything in it. It's just a gorgeous, and it's got um, a chef right here over the chef. And you got your double sinks. You got your sink here, your sink here, your tub right there. Oh my God, you guys, and here's the shower. Oh, it's got that old rustic look. I love it, look. I love it. Oh, let's get a look right here. Right here. Right here. Your drainage. 
Man, oh man. Your commode right here. Okay, here's your closet. Right here. I don't want to go too far in because you may not see me. So this is the master bedroom. Oh, look. Once you look at the shower, you can see that right here. I got to go check the prices of these two homes. This is the master. And it's nonsense you come in the door and you go. I guess the master, you know what? <clears throat> you can, the master bedroom, you can see. I like the way that's designed because your room is off. It's off from the rest of the house and you can see. Okay, come on out and you can see. I like this. Hmm. I like the design. Love it. Okay, now let's check out the kitchen. Okay, oh wow, that's beautiful over the top of the table. I like it. Once again, I would love for them to give me the decorations. The table. But I like the way this is over the table right here. The kitchen is your living area and your kitchen. Mm. I love it. Your double sided refrigerator. Let's see. Your dishwasher. I was against the dishwasher at first, but I'm no longer against the dishwasher anymore. Your dishwasher. And you got a lot of cabinets in here. That smoke alarm is... I like the vented hood. Wow. The vented hood. Mm. By the lights being hooked up, everything is on in here. Y'all, it's kind of cool today. But comfortable because it rained... It's been raining lately, and it was good for me to get out today. I like the cabinets, the countertops. See, I'm telling you all, the less the better. You can, this, this, this here is decorated so beautiful. If you put no more in here or less, it still is a beautiful home. It's still a beautiful home. You all? Okay, here's your island right here. And the island is not too tall for me. Like it. Like it. <laughs> okay, look. This is what they got in the window. This is where they are located. This is the name. Right here. Hmm. This right here comes with your double sinks like i said and then you can do what your sprayer you want with your sprayer i love the floor i love this color on this floor i might well i probably would go a little lighter if i had it to have them to design it the way i want because i do youtube and i need all the light colors that i can get once again my grandkids are small i mean our beat it's big okay I guess your TV goes right here. Your socket and all. We're gonna go see what the bedroom. This is your living space right here. Right off there, there's your kitchen. So it's right off of there. But this will make a beautiful, beautiful home for someone. I love that picture. It talks to you. I like it. Look at here. Oh my God. This is nice like it let's see let's go down here and let's see <clears throat> wow this is different i didn't show you all that in the kitchen okay i'm pulling back and i'm trying to let you all see the kitchen and the dining area right here right here Okay, 
And this is your living area. Okay, here's a closet and right off the living area. This is a little small closet. Once again, y'all, I'm becoming a minimalist. It ain't gonna take a whole lot. Not just I'm becoming a minimalist with things, also with clothing. Hmm, okay. This is just right. This is just right. Um, would I buy this one? You bet your bottom dollar I would. Okay, you can hang your stuff up in here. This is your utility room right here. You have a rack over the top to be able to put your different detergent if you like or whatever you want in there. Nice size cabinets in here. I like the hardware to handle, so I like that. Okay, here goes another. Okay, this is your, um, I know what this is. This is your furnace right here. Comes with a little smaller, this closet door doesn't, for the hold your furnace, it doesn't go all the way down. So this kind of like a door, it doesn't come all the way down. I like that. Okay, once again, here's another bedroom. They went with charcoal in this whole house mostly with the paint color. You can tell the batter. The smoke alarm battery is going down. Okay. Here's a little closet. Right here. I guess my grandkids will probably stay in here. Probably stay here. <laughs> okay. Let, let's see right here. That's one bedroom. This is... That's two bedrooms. This is three Three bedrooms. Let's see what the closet looks like in here. Let me bring you all. Once again, this is a double wide manufacturer home. Okay, this is nice. Three bedrooms, okay. Now let's look at this bathroom is pretty decent size two full bathroom the master got a full bathroom and this is a full bathroom I love the mirrors in here you all how it's hanging there we go nice size tub yeah And cabinet, once again, I like the way it's not, it, 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 it's beautiful just the way it is. Less is better for me. I mean, to each his own, I just want less. I just don't want stuff, I don't want to take care of stuff anymore. But this, this place has everything in it, no matter how you want to decorate it. For this manufacturer home, it's beautiful as is. Even if you don't put anything in it, you can go more if you like. You can go less. I'm just a minimalist. I don't want to go with more stuff. Okay, you all. Just show you all just a little bit around here. Going a little bit slower so you all can see. Let's go outside so you can see the uh, outside of it. Once again, we come through the front door. And uh, this would give me a problem in the country. But I love it. I like it. I love it. But I done broke with the weed eaters going and them ride lawnmowers are going. This is the way it looked when you come in. Now, let me shut the door. <clears throat> All righty. Well, I'm not going to cut the camera off. I guess I'll take you with me down the stairs. What you think? All righty. I love that tree right there. Let's go see what this one is all about. Okay, this is the outside of the home we just looked at right here. It's a beautiful day out here today. 
But I couldn't walk out here with shorts on because it's kind of the wind is kind of blowing. But it's very, very pretty out here. Okay, this is number three. Let's see what this one. Okay, let me show you the outside of this one before we enter this one. I'm going to ask for the paperwork on all three of these. I try to videotape the paperwork for each one of these. Okay, look. I love it. This is beautiful. Let's go up the stairs. This got a little small porch on it right here. It's got a little small porch right here. Hmm. Love the door, you all. Don't you guys love that door? Side window right here. Excuse the noise. It's a highway is right there. So if you guys uh come down Magna call come down 61 South, you'll be able to see this place. Okay, this one comes with a window over here. Glass window. Glass window. I love this door. see this one I, I hadn't been in this one wow no soon I come through the door there it is that's the living area let's see what it has to offer let's see the little dining area focus I hope you all can see over to the side what would I do with that send my kids over there my grandkids over there wash our hands over there it'll work I love that little sink area right here also I could put if I got my laptop I could sit it right here but being just me you all could also put something right here if you like it's got that rustic look rustic look cabinet you can put something up there if you like this is beautiful just the way it is, too. Okay, somebody must have heard me talking. <laughs> the microwave. Wow, it won't open. It's the way I'm opening it, I believe. Okay, I open it in a minute. I got to pull it out. Okay, this is down low. This is what I like by me being short. Your island. You got a nice size island in here. Wow, this looks just like regular pomegranate. This is what I want right here to eat. <clears throat> Let's see. You got your electric stove right here. And your vented hood up here. And your cabinet right here. Comes all the way down. And let's see. Wow, you got a lot of room in there. Look how far that thing. That thing goes way back there. I still ain't came to the. Wow. Wow. Got a lot of places to put your spices. Once again, I would like them to give me some of the stuff that's already in here. So I can decorate it just the way it is. Double side uh, ref refrigerator. Now, this is a single. This doesn't have the double side. But it has the nice sprayer and all right here. The windows are beautiful. Hmm. Love it. Love it, 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 love it. I'm not trying to take you all fast. I got somewhere else I gotta go and look around at. I don't think I'm gonna look at more manufactured homes. I'm thinking about going to look at the car lot. Uh, go look at some cars next. Hopefully I got enough memory on here. Okay. The floor. Oh, this is some nice carpet. Now, once again, I wouldn't go with carpet because I'm just not with the, I don't want to waste anything. And 
for some reason when I had carpet at my other home, it was like you got to get a steam cleaner, you got to go get the carpet cleaner, you got to go get this, you got to go get that. And I'm like, oh God, no. Okay. This is nice. I love it. There goes your fireplace. Hmm. I love the colors of the wall right there. See the window? See when you come in that front door? That front door is right there. And there's your kitchen right there. I'll show you all another look of it. I guess this must be the master. The master bedroom is big. Hmm. Beautiful master bedroom. Let's see. Let me come off of here and let you all see the master bedroom. You got two windows in here of the master. And I love the way it's made. You got your ceiling fan here. Wow, you all get ready for this. Are you guys ready? I'm going to show you the bathroom. The bathroom is beautiful when I just turn my head to the side. I love the sinks. Are you guys ready to see the sinks? Oh, my God. This bathroom is gorgeous. Ready? Boom. Love it. Love it. Nice size tub. Right here. The window is right up over the tub. Love it, you all love it. Shower. Once again, you can sit down right here. Magnolia got some nice homes. I love that shower head right there. It's big enough. And there's your sinks. I love the sinks. This is what I want you guys to say. Look. I love it. I love it. And your mirror. And your sink right here. And your sink right here. I love it. And your restroom. Your toilet. This has a lot of room in this one. You got your toilet. Then you got some more walking space. Wow. This is the master bedroom closet you have I guess you can have both sides with me you know nobody living with me I have hers and mine mine and mine hers and hers mine and mine <laughs> you got little cabinets over this way right here I love it Beautiful. And here you got your little island thing in here. And you can sit. And see, once again, I put my one shirt here. I put me a shirt right here. I'm going to go way over here and put the other, a part of two pair of pants. Because I became a minimalist. I don't want clothes taking care of me either. I would have more clothes than that, but one pair of pants, two pair of pants, one shirt, two shirts. <laughs> but you got enough room to do a whole lot. Look, you can put shoes in here. You can do a whole lot of different things on both sides. I mean, as a couple, you have a, a spouse. Does this come in here with it? I think it does. It hooked with that. I love this. It hooks in there with that. Okay, this is the master bedroom. So we went to one bad one bedroom already. So let me do it this way so you all can see where I came in. This is the closet right there. That was the closet. This is the bathroom. What we say, can I go to the laboratory? This is the laboratory, you all. Nice flooring. Love the floors. 
this is the master bedroom. So when I walk out, let's see what's down here. Okay. Ooh, okay. Okay, there's the kitchen. Love that bending hood over that stove, if I didn't say so myself. Love it. You got your one window in the dining area. And you have this over here. Okay, now let's go. Okay. I just came out of the master room. Okay, I love that door right here. God, I love that door. That was one bedroom. Okay, here's your utility. Utility offers a lot. They have a lot going on in here that's very nice. You have your cabinets, your washer and dryer hookups, and your cabinets right here. You've got a cabinet over here. You got one window and the door, you have a nice size door and you have places to hang your stuff at. If you got shoes and all, you have other places to put stuff at right here. Would I buy this one? You bet your bottom dollar I would. This is your um, utility room with your hot water heater. And I guess this one must be your furnace right here. Ooh. Let's see. Yeah, that's your furnace right there. Manufactured homes have came so far. Okay. Focus. Focus. Okay. Here's your other bathroom. So you got two full-size bathrooms. And you got your big tub. Your commode. Then you got your sink. This is another bedroom right here with one big size, oversized window. I love this. They came back with now since these homes are got bigger windows in the inside. Nice size closet. And the floor is just like a walk-in closet. Beautiful. So we got four bedrooms in this one. Okay. Another bedroom. Did we say four bedrooms? What did I say? Let me see. Let me go back and look. We got the master bedroom. You, this is another bedroom. So this is a bedroom. This is a bedroom. That's a bedroom. So we got uh, one, two, three, four bedrooms in this one. That's your utility room that we came to. Once again, this is your living area. That bedroom is right there. The master bedroom is right there. Come on down. There's your kitchen. Gotta love it. I like these two windows right here. Did you guys see the porch? You guys seen the porch, but let's go out here again. A little small porch area. Right here. Alrighty. No, you're Vicksburg, Mississippi. Let's see when I come back this way so you guys can see that one right here. 
Now, after I get the paperwork on these three houses, I'm going to look at a car. So I want you guys to come along with me because I am so um, enthused with Jeeps. People say Jeeps wasn't good, but my Jeep Cherokee I used to have, that Jeep Cherokee took care of me. I'm not lying. So I'm going to look at some cars, see what we can. So you guys come along with me. These are the houses that we just looked at. I like the way that is. I would like want those bricks right there. I know if they move it, you would have to do it yourself probably. All righty, be back. You all, this is the second one right here of the floor plan. We don't have the third one off hand of the floor plan, but this is the size right here. I don't know if you want to give me the price, y'all. I don't know if you want to give me the price. Do you want to get <laughs> Okay, so you all, look at, um. oh, here's the business card. If you're looking for a businessman, look, how you pronounce your name, Chad? Yes. Weekly? Yes. Okay, you guys, look. Here, let me focus on his phone number. Focus. Oh, my God, I'm trying to focus on his number. There he is right here. Would you like to be seen? Okay. He don't want to be seen, y'all. All right. And here's the, you say this one is the what? This one is the what? The third one? It's the something. That's the Eisenhower. You don't know if that's the third one or the third one? The third one? This is the third mobile home, manufacturer home I've seen, you all. This is the four plan right here. Okay? So here you go, right here. All right. I'll be hollering at you later. Let's come on, go over here with the cars with me. All right, y'all. Check out this Jeep right here. I need to find out. I'm waiting on a salesperson to come. This is the one that I really like. Right here. I used to have a Jeep, and I'm telling you, that Jeep kept me really, really good. I don't like this color right here, though. This color. I don't like that color. I think I would love a black or deep gray or something like that. And then there's another one I seen that I liked. Let me see. It was the one that the Jeep was different right here from the one I did see. And this one is almost this one is almost based on the old style right here. This one is almost like the old style. Jeep Cherokee. I'm gonna test drive this one. $36,991. I learned one thing, y'all. If you can get something, go for it. We ain't here for one time. We ain't coming back. All right. Y'all, how did this color look? It's almost like a charcoal. It's almost like a charcoal. So y'all, we're gonna take a look in the inside, all right? Okay. No, I'm gonna be on camera. Okay. But all right. I'm not gonna say anything. Y'all, this is the salesman right here in Vicksburg, Mississippi. Where are we located at? What store is this? This is Blackburn Motor Company in Vicksburg, Mississippi, around North Punish Road. <laughs> nice salesman. Nice. Okay, y'all. All right. Wait. Let me wait. Let me get. Wait. I got it. I got it, y'all. I got it. I got it. I got it. Here y'all go, right here. Here's his card. Let me focus. So y'all can see his number. Right there. Ask for him when you come to Vicksburg, Mississippi, especially when you're looking for a Jeep. What is this Jeep? This is a Grand Jeep Cherokee. Yeah, but y'all names. What do you sell? Uh, Blackburn Motors. Or we sell you got Chrysler, the... Dodge, uh, Jeep, Nissan, also. Okay. Yes. All right. All righty, you all. Let's check out the inside of this Jeep, y'all. Clean. I like this. This is really nice and clean until I get on the dirt road. I love the tires on this one compared to the other one. So this is a Jeep Cherokee what? This is a Grand a, Cherokee. A Grand Cherokee. Yes. Okay. Okay. Let me get on that side and then I can see. And you guys can look in the inside. You guys, the back um, 
view, this part right here, you all, it's totally different. It's much, much clearer. And this, oh, wait a minute. This one don't come with the two windows. No, this just the uh, sunroof. The sunroof? Yes. Remember we went to the other one that went back to back? And went doo -doo. Yeah. That's the that only one. Right. Yes. That, yes. How many more you all have to that one? I think uh, we only have one left. Okay. Those. All right. You all, I'm going to test drive this one and see how it's going to come out. All right. All right. And let you all see the inside. I'm finna go for a test drive. I'll be right back. Okay, once again, now what did you say they call this one? This is the Upland version of the Grand Cherokee. And what year is this? 2020. 2020? And yeah. what did we say the price was on that sticker price? Uh, the sticker price is $36,991. Okay, you all. And I'll show you when I get back how the back seat looks. Okay. I'm just trying to take out all the notes that he said because I know y'all will come back on me and ask me what was that? What was that? All right. Okay. Okay. He's moving it right now. Y'all tell me how y'all like that one. I really love it. Look. Oh yeah. I love that color. At first I was against it. But no. I like it. Yeah. I like it. Two thousand and twenty. Y'all, we here, like I say, in Vicksburg, Mississippi. Blackburn. I remember when they was over there in another street. Y'all, I really do like that. Let's see what we say the price was. $36,99. So you might as well say $37,000, $38,000. Because by the time you finish with interest and everything, it might be about over $40,000. Over the interest and all. All right. Y'all like this one right here? I do like the fat tire. And take the doles off. Yeah. Me, myself, I don't think I would look like this at all. Let me let y'all see a good one of it. $49,000. Okay, y'all. I made it back home. Let me know what y'all think about those manufactured homes and that Jeep Cherokee, that Jeep. I think that was a really nice vehicle. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and hit that notification bell, bell button. And let you know when all of our videos come out. All right? All righty. Look how pretty it is out here today, y'all. It's beautiful out here. Oh, yeah, if I think about it. You know what that mean right there all right later